Hello, future fans. In the vastness of the cosmos, our tiny blue planet harbors a growing problem of space junk. As human ambition propels us further into the stars, the problems of our progress lingers in Earth's orbit. The ever-expanding collection of defunct satellites, spent rocket stages, and other man-made debris pose a significant threat to operational spacecraft and crewed missions alike. So join us on this in-depth, fun, and speculative exploration of the history of space junk, its potential consequences, and the imaginative solutions that could one day address this celestial conundrum. Our tale begins in the 1950s with the birth of the space age. The launch of Sputnik 1 in 1957 marked humanity's first foray into space, and with it came the genesis of the space debris problem. Not long after, the United States sent Explorer 1 into orbit in 1958, adding to the collection of objects encircling our planet. As more countries ventured into the final frontier, Earth's orbit became increasingly cluttered. Throughout the following decades, space debris incidents grabbed headlines and highlighted the risk posed by our extraterrestrial litter. In 1996, the French satellite Ceres suffered a crippling blow from debris originating from an Aryan rocket. The destructive encounter served as a wake-up call for the global community. The 2009 collision between Iridium-33 and the defunct Russian satellite Cosmos-2251 further emphasized the urgency of this issue, as the incident generated thousands of new debris fragments. Fast forward to the early 21st century and Earth's orbit is home to over 128 million pieces of space debris. These objects span an impressive range of sizes, from tiny micrometeoroids to hulking defunct satellites. Most debris can be found in two primary orbital regions, low Earth orbit and geostationary orbit. The risk posed by space junk are both real and terrifying. Operational satellites, the International Space Station, and crewed spacecraft all face the danger of high-velocity impact from debris. Such collisions could result in catastrophic damage or even loss of life. Moreover, an unchecked increase in space debris could trigger the dreaded Kessler syndrome, a domino effect of collisions that would render certain orbits entirely unusable. As we pair into the murky depths of the future, several trends suggest that the space debris problem may worsen. The rise of mega constellations such as SpaceX Starlink and Amazon Project's Cupier threatens to exacerbate the situation. These ambitious projects involve launching thousands of satellites into orbit, significantly increasing the number of objects zipping around our planet, and consequently, the likelihood of collisions. Furthermore, ongoing advancements in space exploration will likely attract more countries and private companies to venture beyond Earth's atmosphere. As a result, our orbital backyard will become even more congested, further contributing to the accumulants of space debris. Addressing the space junk problem requires innovative thinking and daring solutions. Active debris removal has emerged as a promising approach. ADR involves deploying specialized spacecraft or robotic systems to capture and dispose of debris. For example, the European Space Agency Clear Space One mission scheduled for 2025 aims to plunk a defunct satellite from orbit and demonstrate the feasibility of such techniques. Enhanced debris tracking and collision avoidance systems are also crucial for mitigating space junk risks. By improving our ability to monitor and predict the trajectory of debris, spacecraft operators can maneuver their assets to avoid catastrophic encounters. The development of artificial intelligence and machine learning algorithms offers the potential to revolutionize our tracking capabilities, enabling more precise and timely predictions. Another essential aspect of space debris management is responsible end-of-life satellite disposal. This can be achieved through deorbiting satellites, allowing them to re-enter Earth's atmosphere and burn up, or by relocating them to graveyard orbits, remote regions of space where defunct satellites pose minimal risk of operational spacecraft. Now let us venture into the realm of the truly speculative disposing of space junk by sending it into the sun. This audacious solution involves launching debris on a trajectory that would ultimately guide it into the sun's fiery maw, where it would be vaporized in a blaze of glory. However, this approach comes with its own set of challenges. The high energy cost of reaching the sun, as well as the potential for debris to detach during the journey and create even more space junk, are formidable obstacles to overcome. Nevertheless, the idea remains a fascinating and provocative possibility for future space debris management. 
As we stand at the precipice of a new era in space exploration, our responsibility to address the space junk problem has never been more critical. The history of space debris serves as both a cautionary tale and a call to action, reminding us that our pursuit of the stars must be accompanied by an unwavering commitment to environmental stewardship. The speculative solutions we've explored from active debris removal to hurling space junk into the sun underscores the importance of creative and ambitious thinking. Harnessing the power of human ingenuity, we can transform our orbital landscape from a treacherous minefield into a safer, more sustainable environment for generations of spacefarers to come. In conclusion, as we continue to forge our path among the stars, it is crucial that we remember the lessons of the past and apply them to the future. The space debris problem is a testament to humanity's capacity for innovation and exploration, but it also serves as a stark reminder of the consequences that can arise from unchecked progress. By embracing imaginative and daring solutions, we can secure a future where space remains accessible and safe for all who venture into the great unknown. As we venture further into the cosmos, it becomes increasingly evident that the space debris problem is a global challenge requiring a collective response. International cooperation and coordination are paramount in tackling the issues effectively. Several organizations, such as the United Nations Office for Outer Space Affairs and the Interagency Space Debris Coordination Committee, are already working to foster collaboration and promote best practices for debris mitigation. The development and implementation of international regulations and guidelines are essential for managing space debris. The IADC's Space Debris Mitigation Guidelines and the United Nations Space Debris Mitigation Guidelines provide a foundation for responsible space operations. However, there is still much work to be done in ensuring compliance and updating these guidelines to address emerging challenges. As spacefaring nations and private companies continue to expand their presence in space, it is crucial to establish binding international agreements and treaties that govern debris mitigation and removal. These agreements should incorporate innovative technologies and strategies while balancing the interests of all stakeholders, including emerging spacefaring nations and commercial enterprises. The future of space exploration is inextricably linked with our ability to address the space junk problem as a sustainable manner. As we develop novel technologies and embark on ambitious missions, it is imperative that we prioritize environmental stewardship in space alongside scientific discovery and commercial expansion. New propulsion technologies such as electric and plasma propulsion systems hold promise for reducing the generation of debris by increasing the efficiency and maneuverability of spacecraft. Additionally, Advanced materials and manufacturing techniques such as 3D printing could enable the development of modular and repairable spacecraft, reducing the need for launching multiple satellites and, in turn, limiting space debris creation. Embracing a circular economy mindset in space operations can also contribute to long-term sustainability. This may involve designing spacecraft for disassembly and reuse, promoting the in-orbit servicing and refueling of satellites, and even utilizing resources found in space, such as asteroid or lunar regolith, for manufacturing and construction. The challenges and opportunities presented by space debris will shape the course of human exploration and utilization of space in the coming decades. By confronting these challenges head-on and embracing innovative, sustainable solutions, we can ensure that our cosmic legacy is one of responsible stewardship and boundless discovery. As we stand on the threshold of a new era in space exploration, one marked by human missions to Mars, the commercialization of low-Earth orbit, and the potential discovery of extraterrestrial life, our commitment to addressing the space junk problem must remain steadfast. The path forward is paved with both obstacles and opportunities, but with preservation perseverance, imagination, and collaboration, we can secure a brighter, cleaner future among the stars. To achieve a future where space is free from the hazard of space debris, it is essential to inspire and educate the next generation of scientists, engineers, and policymakers by fostering an understanding of the space junk problem and the importance of sustainable space operations. We can empower future leaders to make informed decisions and develop innovative solutions. Educational initiatives should emphasize the interdisciplinary nature of space debris mitigation and highlighting the roles of various fields, including physics, engineering, and 
environmental science and international relations, encouraging students to engage with these subjects through hands-on projects, competitions, and internships can foster a sense of responsibility and passion for the sustainable development of space. Public engagement is another crucial aspect of addressing the space junk problem. Raising awareness among the general public about the risk and challenges posed by space debris can lead to greater support for research, policy initiatives, and international collaboration. Efforts to engage the public can take various forms, such as museum exhibitions, documentaries, art installations, and social media campaigns, each contributing to a broader understanding of these issues. The space debris problem is a multifaceted issue that encompasses science, technology, politics, and ethics. As we stand on the cusp of unparalleled advancement in space exploration, we must recognize our cosmic responsibility to preserve the environment that makes these achievements possible. The challenges we face are daunting, but they are also unique opportunities for growth, innovation, and global cooperation. By embracing the lessons of the past, daring to imagine bold solutions, and fostering a spirit of unity, we can overcome the obstacles before us and ensure that our future among the stars is one of prosperity, sustainability, and boundless wonder. As we close this comprehensive, speculative, and entertaining odyssey into the future of space junk, let us carry forward the knowledge we have gained and the inspiration it has ignited. Together we can confront the challenges of space debris and leave a lasting legacy of responsible stewardship for generations of spacefarers to come. Please, share, like, and subscribe to help educate people on this important topic. Thank you, and have a wonderful day.